So what could possibly go wrong? I'm on an ancient Somerset bridge and this is the old pre-bridge and there's a river crossing. Um, I'm not quite sure how deep it is, but you can just see there in the center. Sorry, my iPhone's focusing there, the gravel, top dead center. So I'm gonna come down here and I'm gonna come through the stream. I just had to try it, didn't I? She's uh talk about giving myself a heart attack. That water was deep. <laughs> Do you know what though? My friends know that uh, my life has changed since my accident and no doubt what I try is classified as daft. But we all have such a short time left on this planet that why would we not? Oh, she cuts out on uh, any revs at all, so forgive the pun, maybe she's flooded. Well, I pushed her back. There's my Davida helmet, it's gone. And uh, I'm not quite sure what's wrong, but I think she might be flooded. I'll tell you, all in a day's game. So, the pub is about a mile <laughs> at Allampton. Well, the good news is, <laughs> my temporary oil repairs worked. My horn doesn't work. That is absolutely full of water. The water came, well, you'll see the video, but the water came up to here. So next inspection will be the electrics uh, inside. Oh, bloody Nora. Inside the battery cover. see what water ingress I've got inside the electrics. Now she starts and she ticks over, but as soon as I apply any throttle, she dies. So at the moment, I'm completely unseen to what I'm dealing with. But I gotta be honest with you. Beautiful summer's day. Yeah, there's water in the battery box. There's water everywhere. Soddy now. There's water on all the electrics. The battery's absolutely soaked. Oh, look at that. It's absolutely soaked in water. Negative earth. So we'll get that out. And, uh, yeah. Certainly won't help matters. Uh, so, water's gone to about there. Looking at the water in here. But uh, she's a self generating uh, electronic ignition system, so she doesn't need battery power. 
to run the engine. But what she does need is clearly a dry uh, stator and rotor in order to generate that electricity. But my oil lines have held. All the wiring whilst wet looks integral. Um, the only fuse. Let's have a look. <clears throat> Fuse is okay. Battery's very wet. <laughs> so it's certainly gone up to there, hasn't it? But uh, take my air filter out. 1950s air filter. Yeah, there's water in the bottom of the air filter. But there's no evidence at all of water in the um, carburetor inlet. Let's give her a start, see what she starts like. Let's get that battery gently out of the way. And then we'll take the seat off and we'll have a look at all of the uh, electronic ignition systems. Just put that in there temporarily. But obviously, no, I've got no electrics. You can hear that. That's I think my horn might have water in. Well, I've been at the roadside about 40 minutes now. I've dried her off. I've still got to rebuild the, uh, the innards of the battery box. Um, I don't know what else we can do. Let's, uh, I'm blathered for the pub. And it's a posh pub by any description. But anyway, they'll have to take it or leave it, won't they? My money's as good as everybody else's. Let's see if she goes. Let's give her a carb tickle, give her a bit more petrol. Here we go. Let's go to the pub. Lord Almighty. 